What's good, everyone? Shmay Minasaurus here, back again on some Horizon 3. This time around, we're coming at you with the, uh... Ugh, sorry, I had to do a little stretch there. Coming at you with the, uh, the Corvette Z06 Horizon Edition. And I know what you guys are thinking. Holy shit. He's got printed tires. Whatever the hell they're called. Here's the thing. I'm pretty sure that they're, uh, sport tires. <laughs> because when I go to race, as you can see, there's quite a jump in the PI. And the stats so I'm gonna go ahead and assume that they're sport and I can deal with that uh, but yeah as far as the width we got 285s in the front smallest we can get and 335s in the rear smallest we can get I'm leaving it the way it looks the way that you get it from the roll I, I actually kind of like the way it looks um, I took the Forza arrow off the front just because you know Forza arrow and, I, and then I realized while I was tuning that this stock wing has adjustable uh, arrow kind of threw me off but anyways um, god damn I don't know where the hell I'm going right now I'm pretty sure that this comes factory pooper charged if not that's just how they put it in uh, drivetrain that's all race uh, hmm. sorry guys I was up all night last night watching Black Mirror and holy crap that show is just Trivi. Uh, everything's race except for the weight. The weight is sport. So uh, I don't even know what's done to the upgrades because I'm pretty sure I just left it how it was. I didn't want to go into S2. So if we get uh, there, we go 669 all the way around. Should be enough to kick those what, 335s out. So yeah, stock fuel, stock ignition, sport exhaust. Stock cams, stock valves, like Jesus, stock block, stock pistons, stock pooper charger, Jesus, and a short flywheel. Oh, I promise you guys, I woke up like an hour ago, and I was like, oh shit, I forgot, I need to record. I don't know why I'm still yawning. I need to go grab me an AL8. If any of you are from uh, Louisville, Kentucky, you know what the hell I'm talking about. PSI 3227. The gearing, I'm not too sure yet because this thing has eight gears and I don't know how the hell to tune eight gears. So I'm going to try that out. You guys can pause it right there if you want to look at it. Uh, the alignment is 2, 4, and 7 for the camber toe, 0.3 in the rear. Uh, caster is 7. Roll bars are 3150 and 2205. And we went with a. Uh, it's like a 140 split, 540 for the front, 390 for the rear, slammed it, 87 for the rebound, 3.8, 3.2 for the bump, uh, arrow is what it came as, I don't, we're going to see, we're probably going to be adjusting this a couple times just to see how it feels, um, breaking 65.50 and a lock diff as usual, I love you. It's funny because I want to go join... I want to go join Slap, because I think, yes, yeah, I want, I want to go join him, and he messaged me on Facebook, and he's like, hey, I'll see you, doing this Catch Me If You Can video, I was like, I have no idea what that means, but alright, and then I was like, well, this will be bad, because, you know, I'm just going to be taking up a spot in the lobby, I'm over here trying to slide, not drive around the map trying to catch a goddamn fucking slip train, okay? Longest you break ever. Alright, let's see how these gears work here. Holy grip. I feel like I'm going so fast in this car. Overall, I have to say, it's not bad. I think the arrows is making it feel kind of weird to me. It's 
it's so weird seeing seeing the printed tires. All right, so let's change the arrow. I really like the way that the that rear wing looks. We're gonna go to like half. I'm guessing that's about half. 218. And then we'll go all the way down. See if I can notice the difference. Stay in third. Fourth felt like I was about to straighten out and just take off like a rocket ship. Definitely feels better now. Now that I've lowered the arrow, I heard something. Holy shit, you almost hit me, bro. Blue shark Greg. You dick. Well, yeah, this thing is feeling uh, pretty good, not gonna lie. Oh, I jinxed myself. I done jinxed myself. <laughs> yeah, I need some caffeine. I need to wake the hell up. Trying to see if I could r ride the brakes in this thing, but uh, big ass tires. Alright. Alright. Not too sure how. What the hell are you doing over there? Cause see, I joined him up there at Service Paradise, and he's parked right there. Like that's that's like nowhere for them to drive, man. What the hell? <sighs> Excuse me. Oh man. Yeah, if you guys haven't watched Black Mirror, I highly suggest you do. It is such a mind fuck. Like, holy fuck. <laughs> Barbecue body parts. Okay. No. I just tried now a little bit. I didn't want to hit that guy. I feel like the tire width for me is a little bit of a problem because I can't I can't be as smooth as I've gotten with 265s and street tires. The sport tires I definitely feel the grip change between the different tire compounds. That's really that's 100% like guaranteed. Like I'm pretty sure if you go watch any other video of me on this section, my speeds are probably up quite a bit. I mean, I like the speed, don't get me wrong. You guys know me, I've always liked to have, you know, a, a fast drift bar. But sometimes it doesn't make for the best uh, tandems whenever you're running with people. I mean, I can definitely see myself using this car. <clears throat> Guaranteed. Guaranteed. Like this this tune really works. But I just need to go ahead and adjust. Oh god. We're gonna need to go ahead and adjust um a couple things. Figure out why I'm so twitchy with it. I think I might need to raise the front tire pressure.
Why isn't that getting any points? I, I don't understand why I didn't get points there. So I'm gonna go ahead and whoops, 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 whoops. I'm gonna go ahead and raise the front tire pressure to let's say 40. <clears throat> Excuse me. Let's see how 40 feels. Oh God. Jeez, it almost feels like the front is gripping more now. Try to play chicken with a net with AI. Doesn't work out too well. There we go. Last entry. Terrible. Absolutely terrible. I know I shouldn't have pulled the E right there. All right, well, overall, I have to say this car is pretty nice. Like, it's definitely a higher speed drift car for sure. I feel like I'm definitely hauling ass while I'm sliding, that's for sure. Uh,. Well, I use it over that S14 that I made the, with the boss kit. Mm, probably not. So far, that has to be my favorite car. Like, I need to get every car I've made feeling like that car. Like that car is so perfect, it needs to it needs to just be feeling like that. The whole game, everything, every game, every game, every car. I can't talk. I need to get some caffeine, guys. You should make mandatory. I'm getting the hell out of here, and I'll see you guys later.